Hello everyone and welcome to the Fry Smiles Oral Health Network. I'm your host Scott Fry and today on the show we're going to be talking a bit about a new and developing topic in dentistry, probiotics. Now probiotics are simply live organisms that have significant health benefits. And I'm sure a lot of you out there are familiar with some of the other applications of probiotics like digestive health, which there are a lot of commercials on TV nowadays about. But we're going to be talking specifically about probiotics in dentistry. And from what we understand about how bacterial communities in the mouth cause disease like gum disease or cavities, we know that there are in fact several strains of bacteria, and actually more than several, that are very, very healthy bacteria and important for oral health. So essentially what we'd like to do is to make choices in our diet and in our daily routines to enhance the growth of these good bacteria. And this is where probiotics come in. So probiotics are helpful in two major ways. They have two major methods of action, so to speak. Number one, they modify proteins in the mouth and affect bacterial byproducts to keep the bad bacteria from flourishing and also they will enhance the growth of very healthy bacteria. And secondly, they can also, they have the potential to colonize areas of the mouth and produce a longer lasting benefit. So what this means is that probiotics uh, can produce various different oral health benefits, anything from improving bad breath to fighting cavities. Now, you can go online and purchase some different probiotic powders. Actually, TheraBreath, I think, offers one particular strain of probiotic. Uh, you can add these powders to uh, your cereal in the morning or just rub them around on your teeth. They also sell mints. But one really great way, one really great source of probiotics is, in fact, yogurt, and specifically yogurts with live cultures like Activia. And if you, not only do these yogurts have calcium and milk proteins, which will help strengthen your teeth, but they have the live cultures and the probiotics that will produce these additional oral health benefits. So I hope you all found this useful today, and I'll see you again next week, and we'll talk more about this new and fascinating area. Take care.